Guys, how's it going? It's your boy Nippy, and today the Vortage just got leaked, and we're gonna go around. We need to talk about it. We're gonna have a look and um, have a look at my reaction. Mala Ulprat suit. Misfortune comes uninvited. It hungers for blood, craving eternal darkness. Ooh. Ooh. Time to repent is over. I will take up arms again. Step out of the shadows and teach them true darkness. <laughs> that is so fucking cool, man. Ooh, and yet, like other pieces of the uh, of the shield and the sword that is so lit. I cannot wait to um, get my hands on this. I am. Um, you, you don't realize just how goddamn excited I am for the Vortigen. Like goddamn, hearing the metal just like whack it. I'm sitting there going, yeah. Let's rewatch it, but like in slow motion. Okay. Watch it really slowly, so we get to like experience the aesthetic. Oh damn! Oh, so he's strapping on his shield. That's right. This is actually a very big Dark Souls reference. This is a knight character, it even has the knight. <laughs> it even has the knight um, emblem, a couple of books. Don't really know what the candles are for. You can tell he's very armoured, even underneath the tablet, he's very armoured. I want a fully armoured version, maybe like Lordbringer. I wouldn't know how tall this dude is. This is actually a Dark Souls reference. Because of the aesthetic, it's got a very Dark Souls 2 aesthetic to it. But the sword, I don't know about the curviness, there might be an option to change it. I really like the hood and the crown. So his castle's getting sieged. Oh, that is sexy. That might be an emote. That is so fucking cool. This is such a fucking distorted sound, Jesus Christ. That is so fucking cool. That might be his pose. That is a Dark Souls 2 reference because of the darkness. Oof. That's the Voyager, boys and girls. Um, I don't know what that is, but um, I've already bought the thing, so let's discuss me. If you were to look in, you got some eyeliner, so maybe you can adjust some wall paint maybe even have an option so he does have um a fully closed in face some people would like that and i do think they will have an option for a fully closed up face uh he is very armored 
he is extremely armored. And he's rocking he's rocking a miniature version of a warden sword from what I believe. It could be mixed between PK and all that. And I'm just trying to study the swords. I don't think we've seen these swords in the background. Look at the background on this dude. He's got some weapons that I have not seen. And I'm trying to just think. Got gladiator's helmet there. But I think his shield's gonna be more spiky. I feel like that's sort of the aesthetic he's gonna have. And I've already bought it. Because this Vortigen's armor actually is a lot different from the one in the trailer, especially the weapons. Um, in the trailer, you could tell that old mates uh, got a bit of, um, you know, a bit of facial hair, or I might be wrong. His eyes are really black, from what I've seen. Um, which could possibly represent that there is an option to uh, give him eyeliner or eyeliner face paint. Uh, it looks cool. I dig it. Really edgy. And if you thought Ice Skies and all the Warden mains running around and they're, you know, Black Wardens, you gotta have a look at this. This guy's got some damn thick eyeliner. Um... What else can we notice from the video? The shield is what I imagine would be a bit smaller, but it's actually fucking big. And from what I've thought about it, like that's like massive. That 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 shield's huge. Like I thought it was like a, you know a kite shield is what we we're all thinking, but no. Surprisingly, it's not. It's more of a conqueror shield, if anything. And if we were to, like, get a full body of this dude again, that shield is... Estimate from his shoulders to his knees, if I was to get that, it covers quite a lot of his body, which is really good, it's protective, and from what I can see, it's made of full metal. So, if I was to make an assumption, we could have what Conqueror had before his rework with the superior block because Warlord's got a wooden shield, Valkyrie's got a majority wooden shield um, but the Vortigen maybe um, we'll just have to see about his playstyle and how he will play out as you can see he's even got um, from the image here he's got some quite tanky you know Chainmail, even some uh, boots and stuff. Um, I cannot tell, like, it's not a fully robed up character from what we were seeing from the bottom bit. Um, that's actually exposed from the side of the legs. Uh, I cannot really tell how long that goes down to, but I'd probably say around his um, heels. Here we go, maybe this. Okay, yeah, see the chainmail around here? He's very tanky, and he's coming out, and that is very, very protective. And yes, um, from what we all thought, yeah, he's rocking the Vortigen from King Arthur. That's probably what it actually is inspired from. And if I was to get an idea, possibly this could turn into chainmail. That's just sort of like the idea I had from the cloth going into chainmail. But that's just, you know, uh, a speculation. But, you know, just going in depth analysis of what we're looking at here. Um, if I ever missed anything, uh, let me know in the comments and uh, I'll catch you guys uh, next time.